welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with another StarCraft 2 commentary. I am the Blue Terran in the north, up against Shifus. Shifus, Skyfus. I, you know, I'm sorry that that name is hard to pronounce. He is the Red Protoss in the east-ish. Um, he, the map is Scrap Station, which is why I have a hard time. Uh, telling you exactly where we spawned. If I put it on a clock face, I would be at the 12 o'clock. He would be at the 2 o'clock. And today has been a, a, a very strange day for me. Uh, I do have uh, jury duty maybe coming up sometime. Um, they want me to... I, I was supposed to call on Friday. And I did. And they told me Friday night to call Monday at noon to find out if I needed to be at jury duty at 1 on Monday. Mm, then I called on noon and they told me, oh no, you don't have to show up today. So I'm like, oh sweet, N no jury duty. Oh, but call tomorrow at noon to find out if you have to be there tomorrow at 1. So they're giving me a one hour notice here and that is not fun. And then I get home and find out that YouTube uh, decided that uh, they do not like my videos. So they did not want to upload them until about 10 o'clock. So that was fun. I do apologize if you guys were waiting for that. There's not much I can do if YouTube does go down. Alright, so um, back to the game. He, the Sifis, Shifis, Skyfis, uh, the Protoss player, is doing some great harassment in my base. He actually killed the SUV that was building the barracks, so that will be delayed slightly. Plus, he's getting two of my um, SCVs off the line as I try to harass him. I did put one back on the line, but he steals my gas. I've never seen this from a Protoss player. He stole my gas. That's not cool. Um, I've always seen it from Zerg players. Uh, Terran players, it would not work because, of course, they could kill the SCV while it was building the... Um, while it was building the base. Oh, he cancels that just in time. While it was building the the refinery. So only Protoss players and Zerg players can get away with this. But I've never seen a Protoss player do it and it, he's doing a great job of it. And he's migrating his his probe magnificently here. He is going to see that I'm putting up a second barracks. Meanwhile he is getting two gateways of his own. Getting a pylon up but oh my gosh he's, he's stopped producing probes. And he's got full energy on his Nexus. Uh, so this this harassment inside my base has really cost him in terms of his opener. Um, he's... Well, I, I don't want to say he's behind here, but... No, I'm going to go and say, go ahead and call it that the micro inside my base has put him behind. Um, I, you know, looking at the APM, I'm still not doing that great. I, you know, 20 APM. I just... I did not let the early harassment bother me too much. The marine popped out. I was able to kill the probe before it was able to run out of the base. Sorry, I did not see that uh, on screen for you guys, but I'm just amazed here that really he stopped producing probes so early. He's only got 11. 11. That, as opposed to my. Well, you know, I don't have that much more, but. You know, I've definitely got more with those mules out. So, I mean, we're looking here. I I'm ahead in the mineral count by almost, at, at times, three to 400 minerals. And here he's going for an early push. Why is he going for the push? It's because I am going for the assimilator. He assumes that these are my only three marines. And when they went over here, he was right. But the rush distance on this map is just so large. Right, he's he's just halfway to my base now. I've already got a Marauder and two Marines out. They should. Well, it will be tough. It depends on the micro, whether or not I'll be able to handle that. But of course, once these three Marines come down to reinforce, he is screwed, and he will not be able to handle that. And now, of course, with another Marauder and two more Marines popping out, he is done for. He pops up, sees that I still have all of that, and he cancels the proxy pylon, sends his, marine, sends his uh, zealots in the stalker all the way back to his base, and I take a hefty lead in the unit's loss count. Um, that, of course, counts the pylon. I, 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 
that's horrible. Why does it count the pylon? But he lost. I'm, I'm gonna say he lost two units there. It also counts that that gas that I killed there. So it is skewed here. But um, I did kill w one stalker there, which costs 125. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and say it's uh, you know because I killed a probe that I'm 125 in the lead. I believe they cost 125. I'm not actually sure. What do they cost here? Uh, they cost actually 175, so I have 175 leads in the unit loss counts. I've spent more across the board, and that's because I still have the lead in income because he has stopped producing probes altogether. He did, he did produce a couple while I wasn't paying attention, but he's still only up to 12 in the mineral lines as opposed to, you know, 20... 20... I have 20, he has 12, and he's he's sending an... I don't know where that SCV, uh, where that probe was going, but it will never make it there. Walk in, use a stim pack. He, of course, doesn't have any upgrades on these guys, um, so I will be able to take them out early. I should be sending these guys in. I don't do that, though. I, I always forget that, because I'm always scared that... If I were to die and he went for the counterattack, I could not rally my troops back in time, but of course that is because I have terrible micro still. And here I start taking out probes that he had to pull on the, off the line, so he's he's down to just two harvesting probes. He's still got a ton of energy on that nexus. He doesn't have any minerals though because he hasn't been saturated this entire time. So a cup he pulls a couple off the refineries so he is out oh, he's looks like he's taken everything off the refineries now and so he's down to just really just these nine probes right now and he's he's not producing anymore what is he doing the, the he's just completely fallen off the face of the earth in this map the, the, really he went for the harass and that didn't work out for him. And, and that really cost him the game. He he couldn't come back from that. He did not have a strategy set. Really, he was hoping to take out my SCV. And, and he did. Let's face it. He took out the SCV on the barracks. But I was still able to get the barracks up. I just sent another SCV out to get it. And I don't think he was used to a player being able to do that. So when you're under harassment, don't let it get to you um, too much. You know, don't send everything out here to take out the, the assimilator as soon as it's built. You know, I don't need that second gas for a while. Just make sure, you know, careful uh, building placement here. He was able to see that second barracks, but I placed this third one underneath it so that the gas would not be able, the, his building here, the, the, the assimilator, would not be able to see that third barracks. And once that was done, and I went and I saw that he went for the attack here, I, I realized, you know, this was an all-in for him. This isn't some, some test, uh, you know, a test group of stalkers and zealous this was all he had so i went for the counterattack. he was not able to build up in time because he was so micro heavy in my base um if you're going for a harass please 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 remember to pump out uh probes scvs whatever you got pump them out go into the mineral line gotta keep that up uh don't go for don't forget to 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 gas when you've only got like 16 s uh, 16 harvesters you know you shouldn't have 300 gas that you you don't have spent with uh, because you're low on minerals. Do I I have you know a little less than that, but you know I still have minerals to cover for it. I'm even getting missile turrets just in case he he had something that I didn't have. I'm even going for an expansion here. You know it was it was a a strategy heavy reliant on that early harass, and as long as you don't panic, as long as you don't make too many mistakes, I did make a couple, but nothing too major to cost me the game, and really, you know, that was all he had, and th what I, I, I'm sorry, that's all I got for you guys, so I, I hope you laughed, I hope you learned, and I hope you enjoyed the game, hope to see you next time, bye.